I am who I'm meant to be. I am who I'm meant to be. Over and now, over and now, again. My future needed clarity. So I could see how you Doubted all that I could do, knowing what I need to do. All I can say, the word is thank you. I think it's what you need to push away from the shore, amongst the waves. Exactly where I want to be. I am where I want to be. Remember the start, remember the start. When my future needed clarity, yes, I needed clarity. So I could see. So I think it's time to test the boiler out. And to do this, we first need to power it up. The boiler itself, we need to change a couple of things on the start. First of all, we need to start the power. And then we need to make sure that this one here is on the start up temperature. And that is the bottom part there. As you can hear now, the fan starts moving. So basically this regulates when the fan should be moving and then during the startup we need to have it started directly. We need to pull this one out to make sure that we actually have suction in the top here. So this one out, this one we turn on and it's time to fill the boiler up with a little bit of wood and we'll start it. Small pieces. Some paper, just to make sure we have something to start up on. Take one gas burner. And when the temperature is up, as you can see, I take this knob and turn it up towards the working temperature. That ensures that this one actually shuts down when the temperature goes down and they have st stopped burning in the wood boiler. As you can see in the top here on that one, we actually have it started to charge the tanks. It's 80 degrees up here and it goes and flows into the tank. So that one is actually doing its job perfectly fine. So let's open the boiler up just quickly, so sh show you guys how it looks now. As you can see when I open it up, you have these really nice flames going. So let's see it again. It's a little bit tricky to see, but 
it stops glowing as soon as I open because of the air pressure air suction it goes on the other side so basically the boiler is now going the system have been installed and I'm pretty happy with that it works so far I have a temporary connection there for the power and that will be swapped out soon it's now a matter of actually testing the system out and we currently have around 250 degrees on the exhaust it's a little bit high I have not um, sorted it down yet uh, I need to get the boiler set up properly to my chimney next part now is as you can see here I have nothing to control the heat it's currently totally manual by turning this knob back and forth like this so stay tuned for next video if you want to see me build that thing and it will look something like this I suggest you subscribe to my channel press the notification bell and stay tuned for me upgrading and I see you next time thanks